I think it's so important for young girls to really start thinking about investing early. If you get an allowance of $5, put 20% away. Why is that important? There's going to be a time that you're going to want something. Maybe it's an iPhone. Maybe it's that you want to go on a trip with your friends. And how amazing is that, that you have that money and you don't have to ask your parents in order for you to be able to go and engage in this wonderful experience. You never, ever, ever want to be in a situation where money is driving the conversation. You want to know that you've taken care of yourself first, and then we can get into deeper conversations about career and other things, but never making a decision out of desperation. And then I love travel. Like that's a huge part of who I am. I'm um, about to go to Cartagena, Colombia this year for my friend's 40th birthday. I'm taking a bunch of women to Paris in April. I want to be able to feed that passion. And so there is a certain amount of money that I'm constantly putting away. But investing can also be not just monetary. I invest a lot of time and energy and money into myself. Um, I have a coterie of coaches that I hired or I barter with when I decided that I was going to go off on my own, become an entrepreneur, because this process did not need to be any more painful than it needs to be. I don't need to reinvent the wheel. People have been entrepreneurs forever. Why can't I just lean on these people to get a little bit of a, a little bit ahead of the game and not really start at ground zero? So I think that investing in yourself can be getting a massage. It can be doing something that's really fun. It's painting. It's drawing. It's something that feeds the other side of your brain. Investing in yourself can just be like being with a friend that gives you energy. But investing in yourself doesn't always have to be monetary. But boy, does that really, really feel so good when you say, I paid for this.